What is going on guys? I hope you all are doing great. So first thing I wanted to go over before I start the video is if you guys are interested in purchasing any of these products, link is down in the description and you can buy all these parts via Amazon. So this repair is for if your home button is not working. It is a very easy and simple fix. If you have little iPhone knowledge, you will be able to complete this repair in under 20 minutes. Let's get started. So for this repair, you are going to need a home button, which you can find in the description and you can buy it via Amazon for very cheap. And you are also going to need a Phillips screwdriver and a pentalobe screwdriver. All right, so let's get right into it. So the first thing that we are gonna wanna do is take our pentalobe screwdriver and go ahead and unscrew the bottom two screws. So now that we've got those screws out of there, it is time to take the digitizer off. So go ahead and take your fingernail and just try and pry in between the digitizer and your phone from the bottom up and just lift your phone upwards. So this repair is actually really easy and simple because we are not going to have to take the digitizer off. There are no flex cables or anything that we have to remove. So we're just going to go ahead and unscrew the bottom three screws on top of our home button assembly. So now that our three screws are off, we can now just gently lift up the back plate, exposing your home button assembly. So there is one tiny cable connected to your home button assembly, and we're just going to want to go ahead and unplug that. And after that is unplugged from the front of your screen, you're just going to want to push your home button assembly through and take your entire home button off. So very simple, now that we have our broken home button off, we are going to go ahead and take our new home button and put it back on. So you are going to want to take your flex cable that's attached to your new home button and fold it over and click it right in to the flex cable port where your old home button was plugged right into. So now it's just putting everything back together. Just go ahead and put your plate back on, put the three screws back in, and you're good to close your phone back up. So now that your Penelope screws are back on and your phone is closed, you are going to want to make sure that your home button is clicking right and everything just feels right. So now at this point you've successfully completed your repair and your home button should be working perfectly. Thank you guys so much for making it to the end of the video. If this helped you out, please like, comment, and subscribe.